Alright. I finally got a replay to work. I sent an email to Epic Games, and apparently the email wouldn't go through them, so I sent them through another ticket, and they closed that one. I don't know, maybe they're working on it, maybe they fixed it, I don't, I don't even know. But how I fixed it is the, uh, because what I was having issues with is the gameplay wouldn't switch off a of drone. So I was on drone free mode, basically, and it wouldn't switch to gameplay on the camera mode. Anyhow, I switched the names over, and then it finally fixed itself. And then it fixed it, basically, I don't even know. So it's fixed now. Anyhow, I don't know if that was on Epic's end they maybe fixed it or it's on my end. I don't know. Anyhow, what I wanted to show in this video is this guy. And I want and I don't want to he's not hacking, but why what I want to show is why is kill for kill a thing? The very mechanic that I think is very stupid. In fact, uh COD ha doesn't have kill for kill. They want to hire Pink for a kill. Which I think is the way this should work. I don't know why. Anyhow, I'm going to take a look at this. This is right, Daniel. In fact, this is a game that I actually got the win in. And this is probably doing part to why I got the win. Not complaining that I got the win. But I just want to point out that why Kill for Kill was even a thing. Because I would have probably faced off the sweat here and not been for Kill for Kill. Probably still would have won with my skill level. But, yeah. Let's, let's play the clip. They both just died. He got hit with a shotgun and then he ate an ASU spray. So, so basically, if you spray with an AR, and someone hits you with the shotgun. It's kill for kill. Now I've been hearing a lot of people saying shotgun versus shotgun's kill for kill. No. If you hit someone with the shotgun, the guy with the less health, even though you hit for more damage, will always win. No matter how much the damage output is, as long as he gets enough damage to kill you and you're less health. Now if it comes to an AR and a shotgun, you can shoot an AR and you can shoot a shotgun. Both you will probably die if that if you're close to each other and you're spraying just like that. Now anyhow. I'm gonna go over and we're gonna watch me now. Okay, well this guy died to storm. Okay? He was up here by Caddy area. So yes, he died to storm. And then here I am. I killed the um slick dude that was over there. I don't even know. I don't even know if I killed him now or not. I think I killed him right here. Yeah, here he is, right here. Yeah. He's down there. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I see. I got a victory L right there. So yeah, he did die, and then I got a victory L. But yeah. But yeah, I got Victor O because the dude died in storm and he was the last guy alive. And then the other dude I killed and then I laughed like a like a little like a little toxic kid. Yeah, I did do that. But yeah, anyhow, kill for kill. Got me the win. I would have faced off against the sweat had it not been for kill for kill. And I probably don't deserve the win because but I got the win anyhow. Not complaining, but I'm complaining the mechanic that needs to be fixed. Kill for kill is so bot. But anyhow, I guess I got a victory out of it for all my complaining and what it's worth. So yeah, that's the video, guys. Let me know what you think of kill for kill in the um in the, in the uh, comment section below. Let me know what you think of that, guys. And also in the comment section, let me know. Let me know what you think of my victory out there. And uh, other than that, that's the video. That's the five-minute video there. So,